Hello, and welcome to Simple Guide, the series where I, Pepper Homie, provide a guide, and I keep it simple. Let's get into it. So this guide will be covering how to make it so that your Xbox allows local co-op on any game that you're playing. So the first thing that we need to do is make sure we have two Xbox controllers connected. Once that's done, you need to navigate to the settings of your Xbox. This can be done by pressing the guide button in the middle of your Xbox controller, and then navigating all the way to the right to your profile and scrolling down to the word settings, and then pressing A. Once we're in the settings menu, you need to scroll down to the devices and connections category. From here, you need to click on accessories. You will then be taken to a screen where you can see your Xbox controller. From here, you need to navigate to the three dots button located underneath your controller. Click that and you'll be navigated to another screen. On this screen, you just need to navigate all the way down to where it says, Turn on Copilot. You will then need to press A on Turn on Copilot. Once you do this, you'll be notified that you are connected to a copilot. Now what this is going to do is it's going to allow inputs from both controllers to count as one input in a game. And to explain that a little further, basically if you're playing a single player game, you guys are both controlling that same person. So if you're playing a game like Skyrim, you guys can both control the character at the same time. Now this can result in a challenging experience when trying to play this way, but I recommend that you decide on who can use what buttons prior to doing this for a better experience. Now, if any of you guys end up doing this, I love to hear your crazy stories. So if anything funny happens, please leave a comment down below. And if any of you guys felt this was very helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing. I'll see you guys next time.